markets are trading with Jessica Rusett from Fig Securities. Jessica, thank you very much for joining us. Now, we've been talking about, um, you know, equity markets remaining remarkably resilient, but a lot of the activity seems to be happening in the, in the bond market and, and US yields. Just talk us through those moves that we have seen post those US airstrikes. Leanne, thanks for having me. So uh, that's right, there's one thing that investors certainly don't like and that's uncertainty in the markets and that's what they seem to be getting at the moment. We had on Friday the unexpected US airstrikes. We also had softer than expected uh, non-farm payroll data out of the US as well. They're expecting um, 180,000 new jobs, it was only 98,000 new jobs. And as a result of that we had the yields rally on the US Treasuries uh, post Bill Dudley's comments uh, regarding the normalisation of the central bank's balance sheet. We then did see them uh, come back a bit, but it certainly did rally when there was that uncertainty. And that's when investors flock to those more defensive assets. Here in Australia on the past week or so, we did have the yields drop on the 10-year government bonds and also more so at the lower, uh, the, the shorter end of the curve in the five-year as well. All right, fantastic. What about Aussie bond, um, bond yields? What, how are we seeing them trading? Yeah, they're trading a bit higher today. They're just staying around, um, not moving in too much of a range, in about one to two basis point range they're trading today. Uh, we'll just wait and see. I think with it being Easter, they will be pretty thinly traded this week, to be honest. I think with all the geopolitical risk that is going on, clients will just be waiting to, um, to see how things do play out and won't be making too much of a big move or position this week. Fantastic, Jessica. We really appreciate the update. Thank you so much for joining us. Thanks, Leanne. Jessica Rousset joining us there from Fig Securities. Well, that's all we have time for on Trading Day for now. Do stay with us. Coming up, we